Hi there, I'm Darren Williams from Python Bytes and in this tutorial I want to show you a program uh, for creating GUIs with WX Python and that program is called XRC Ed. XRC files are used for uh, creating GUIs doesn't use Python script for uh, creating the actual GUI it's like an XML file. Now this this program, I, I love this program. I've used it for years. Uh, it's very easy to learn. You intuitively understand how it works. For example, uh, I want to create a frame. You have these tabs up here that are different widgets. So I click frame and there's a frame. So I just go frame main that's the frame name size we got 500 by 400 and call this my first frame okay and then I'll go and save it XRC add where's my tutorials That's the add frame, and I'll call this M A F. Okay, so there it is. There. I'll just call it M N A. Save that. Okay, then I press F five, and there's a frame. Okay, so and then you can view the XML file. So you go view, show, XML, and that is the code to create a frame. Uh, also, the beauty of using XRC is it's very fast. When you load the program or when you want to do various functions on the application uh, that you build, it's very fast. Now, I have created a program here. It's a bookmarking program. And I've been using this for quite a few years uh, up here bookmark statistics okay got 185 categories 662 subjects and I've got 1846 bookmarks which is huge now this is the database uh, application and I built this using XRC Ed so these are my various categories uh, these are the subjects related to the category I can add new categories and subjects and then I can go to the various categories and then select such as Python all the different subjects related to that and also here uh, generate bookmark list so if I go to Python where are you Python and then choose a subject uh, I Python notebook okay so I got links here so I can do a list so here do it by subject there's a list I can view a list and there's a list there or I can go back here and do a table list go to the web page and there's a table list that's what I've done with this bookmarking program okay so basically it's all built with XRC Ed okay so I will be showing you uh, in the following tutorials how to use XRC Ed and build a or build GUIs. So we'll start out with a frame and then we'll go through each widget on XRC Ed. Okay, I hope this has been helpful. If you have any questions or comments in relation to this video, please leave them below on the video and I will get back to you as soon as possible giving you answers about this. 
till the next tutorial have a good day goodbye